Hello students. So now we are going to discuss about the reaction of halogenation of alkanes. Over here, the most important thing that you need to remember is that halogenation is an example of a substitution reaction and it's not an example of addition reaction. Okay? Here, alkanes, we are going to do a substitution of halogen. We are not going to do addition. Nahi so let's start with the actual reaction. How does the reaction occur? Subsequently, the very first thing what you need to know is whenever alkanes undergo halogenation, you can add, you can either substitute, sorry, you can substitute fluorine or bromine or chlorine or iodine. The substitution of fluorine is called as fluorination, chlorine is chlorination, bromination ka bromination aega, bromine ka bromination aega, and iodine ka iodination aega. Okay. Now, Fluorination, we carry out nahi karte. We don't carry out fluorination for a very simple reason because the reaction is highly explosive and we don't want that to happen in our labs. Also, please remember iodination, we don't carry out iodination either. Kyu nahi karte? Because iodination is a very slow and a highly reversible process. It's a very slow and a reversible process. So, we do iodination. Karenge. And nahi fluorination karenge. So what we would do? We would prefer to do chlorination or we would prefer to do bromination. Right now, hum log study karenge chlorination. So let's talk about studying chlorination. What would be chlorination? Chlorination is substitution using chlorine molecule. So let's see how the reaction occurs. That is chlorination. Let's suppose aapke baas ek alkane hai RH. To this, you are adding Cl2. Acha. In the presence of diffuse sunlight, heat, or UV light, you can either diffuse sunlight use kar sakte ho, heat use kar sakte ho, ya UV light use kar sakte ho. You can use anything. What you will get is H and Cl will combine to give you HCl. What are you remaining with is the R and Cl molecule. They would combine to give you the corresponding alkyl halide. So, hua kya? Aapke paas thaik alkene which got converted into an alkyl chloride or an chloroalkane. Let's understand this with an example. Okay. Man lete hai, aapke paas methane molecule hai. Methane is CH4, but purposefully I have written it as CH3H. That ki hai, reaction explain kar pahe. Dekho. So whenever you take methane molecule to this, you add chlorine. Achha, chlorine, uh, reaction of chlorination will be happening in what? It will be happening in diffuse sunlight, ya UV radiations. What is going to happen? H and Cl combined karke HCl de denge. Acha, what are you left with on the left hand side? You are left with CH3 which will combine with Cl giving you methyl chloride. So aapke paas methane tha which got converted into methyl chloride or chloromethane. Now a very 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 important thing that you need to understand is the reactivity of halogen. What is the reactivity of halogen? Usually fluorine will be greater then chlorine will be greater than bromine, will be greater than iodine. But then fluorination hum karte hi nahi hai because explosive reaction hota hai. So hum log nahi likha bhi nahi hai. We haven't written fluorine. But yes, if you want to write down fluorine, fluorination is definitely more reactive than chlorination, then bromination and then iodination. So over here what we need to remember, the reactivity order of halogen is fluorine greater than chlorine, greater than bromine, greater than iodine. Let's move further. Ek aur important cheez jo aapko samaj nahi hai. Over here, job ko product mila hai methyl chloride. Just check, my dear students. Over here, aapne kitne hydrogens substitute kiye. So you have substituted only one hydrogen atom. Aapne ek hydrogen ko nikala, ek Cl substitute kiya. So therefore, what we will say is that this species is a mono substituted species. Okay, this is a mono substituted species. Achha, now, if you want a species to be mono substituted, matlab aapko sirf ek halogen substitute karna hai, then what you need to remember is that alkane needs to be in excess. Agar aap alkane excess mein lete ho and usme halogen dalte ho, to hi aapko mono substituted products milenge. Otherwise, what will happen? Let's try to understand. You already have CH3Cl, so Let's take CH3Cl. Now, to this, 
मान लो आपके पास क्लोरीन ज्यादा अमाउंट में मतलब हाइड्रोजन एक्सेस में सो व्हाट विल हैपन देखो सर वन मोर हाइड्रोजन इन द प्रेजेंस ऑफ यूवी लाइट विल कंबाइन विद क्लोरीन गिविंग यू एच सी एल नाउ वॉट यू विल गेट इज यू विल गेट सी एच टू सी एल टू मतलब यहाँ पे दूसरे क्लोरीन का सब्सटीट्यूशन हो गया एंड वॉट यू हैव गॉट इज यू हैव गॉट मिथलिन डाइक्लोराइड सिमिलरली सर अगर यही मोलिक्यूल वापस लिया जाए this reacted with one more chlorine because chlorine is an excess again in the presence of uv light what you are going to get sir ek aur hydrogen will get substituted giving you hcl and jo bhi bacha hua species hai aapke paas will combine with another chlorine to form chcl3 which is chloroform now still you have one hydrogen remaining so you take the same species again treated with another chlorine molecule in the presence of uv light what you are going to get again you will get hcl as a by product and now you will get a carbon which is attached to all the flow four chlorine atoms matlab yahan pe ab ja ke reaction stop hoga okay so what has happened sir agar halogen excess mein liya jaye agar chlorine excess mein liya jaye to wo reaction tab tak karta rahega jab tak aap sare hydrogen na substitute kar do methane mein char hydrogen the isliye char substitutions hue इथिन इथिन हैज सिक्स हाइड्रोजन तो उसमें छह बार होगा एंड लाइक वाइज ओके सो दिस इज वन वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग दैट यू नीड टू रिमेंबर दैट यू नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट दिस टू हैपन इफ यू जस्ट वॉन्ट मोनो हेलोजिनेशन देन यू टेक अल्केन इन एक्सेस हेलोजिन इन डेफिसिट फर्दर जस्ट अंडरस्टैंड वन मोर थिंग क्लोरिनेशन दैट इज दिस मैकेनिज्म वॉट वी हैव लर्न इट अकर्स बाय मैकेनिज्म or this reaction occurs by a mechanism of free radical substitution for the is reaction mein aapko bahut sare mixed products milenge mixed products ka meaning kya hai sir hame methyl chloride bhi milega methylene dichloride bhi milega kabhi kabhi chloroform bhi mil jayega thode amount mein thode amount mein carbon tetrachloride bhi milega so aapko jo chahiye the desired product that is methyl chloride you won't get it in maximum amounts you will get all the mixed products which are formed over here and it's because of this same reason because of these mixed products which are formed is same reason ke wajah se this reaction is the least preferred method okay yeah this reaction is the least preferred aapko agar alkyl halide banana hai to aap is method se nahi banaoge okay you will try something else clear about this no worries once again what we said agar halogen deficit mein hoga to mono substitution but if halogen is in large amounts what you will get is you will get a multi substituted product might be dichlorinated trichlorinated or tetrachlorinated or rather you would say jitne hydrogen se utne sare substitute ho jayenge okay one more thing over here what you need to remember is that whenever you have all the hydrogens which are substituted yaad rakhna jab aapke sare hydrogen substitute ho jate hain this type of halogenation okay this type of halogenation is referred as exhaustive halogenation okay why is it called as exhaustive halogenation so because we have exhausted all the hydrogen atoms aapke paas jitne bhi hydrogen atoms the aapne sare exhaust kar liye aapne reaction tab tak kiya jab tak sare hydrogens khatam na ho jaye okay so this is referred as exhaustive halogenation clear let's move further the next thing what we need to understand is what would happen if you have more than two carbon atoms let's try over here man lete hain aapke paas ek molecule propane tha propane is treated with cl2 in the presence of uv light or diffuse sunlight or even in the presence of heat now what will happen you can get two different products there are two different possibilities chlorine the first possibility is chlorine will attack the primary carbon which is the ch3 carbon अगर उसने CH3 का हाइड्रोजन सब्सटीट्यूट किया तो व्हाट विल हैपन सर एच एंड सी एल विल कम्बाइन टू गिव यू एच सी एल एंड यू वुड बी गेटिंग सी एच टू सॉरी सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी एच टू सी एल मतलब क्लोरीन ने प्राइमरी कार्बन के ऊपर सब्सटीट्यूशन किया है बट अगर क्लोरीन ने सेकेंडरी कार्बन के ऊपर सब्सटीट्यूट किया देन वॉट यू विल गेट देन इन दिस केस यू विल गेट सी एच थ्री सी एच सी एल सी एच थ्री ओके Now you must be thinking कि सर वो HCl सी एल कहाँ गया आपने क्यों नहीं लिखा देन आई जस्ट नीड टू यू जस्ट नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड ओवर हियर प्लीज रिमेंबर 
ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री में द बाई प्रोडक्ट आर नॉट दैट इंपॉर्टेंट अनलेस दे आर नॉट टेकिंग पार्ट इन द रिएक्शन अगर एच सी एल किसी और स्टेप में यूज होता रहता तो मैं यहाँ पे लिखता बट एच सी एल कहीं पे यूज नहीं हो रहा एंड हमारा मेन इंटेंशन था फॉर चेकिंग की अल्केन के साथ क्या हो रहा है हमने वो चेक कर लिया अच्छा अब आपको दो प्रोडक्ट्स मिले वट इज द टू प्रोडक्ट द फर्स्ट प्रोडक्ट इज टू क्लोरोप्रोपिन द नेक्स्ट प्रोडक्ट इज वन क्लोरोप्रोपिन एंड वेन एवर यू हैव टू प्रोडक्ट्स एक चीज दिमाग में स्ट्राइक करनी चाहिए इज दैट वेन एवर यू हैव टू प्रोडक्ट्स इसमें से मेजर कौन सा होगा और माइनर कौन सा होगा देन अंडरस्टैंड टू फाइंड आउट वेदर विच वन इज मेजर एंड विच वन इज माइनर यू नीड टू रिमेंबर दैट वेन एवर इट कम्स टू द ईज ऑफ रिमूवल ऑफ हाइड्रोजन और सब्सटीट्यूशन ऑफ हाइड्रोजन टर्शरी कार्बन वुड सब्सटीट्यूट इजिली देन सेकेंडरी एंड देन प्राइमरी अब यहां पर बच्चे चेक करो प्राइमरी एंड सेकेंडरी में कौन सा इजिली सब्सटीट्यूट हो जाएगा तो ऑब्वियसली सेकेंडरी and because secondary is going to get substituted very easily what is going to happen you will definitely say two chloropropane is the major product one chloropropane is the minor product so dhyan rakhna why two chloropropane is the major product because your ease of removal of hydrogen jab hydrogen remove karne ki bari aati hai ya jab hydrogen substitute karne ki bari aati hai the hydrogen of tertiary carbon will be substituted easily then secondary and then primary This is one very 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 important thing that you need to remember. अच्छा अब ऐसे क्यों होता है? We we'll learn it when we understand the module of mechanism of this same reaction. Okay? So next module is the mechanism of halogenation reaction. I hope आपको at least a basic idea of halogenation क्या होता है ये समझ में आ गया होगा. Halogenation में आप सिर्फ substitution करते हो. If possible on one carbon. If possible on टू डिफरेंट कार्बन तब आपके पास दो अलग अलग ऑप्शन आ जाते हैं अगर दो ऑप्शन आते हैं तो यू डेफिनेटली डिटरमाइन हु इज मेजर एंड हु इज माइनर कैसे डिटरमाइन करेंगे बाई द रूल विद सेज दैट वेन एवर हाइड्रोजन नीड्स टू बी रिमूव टर्शरी कार्बन विल लूज द हाइड्रोजन इजिली देन सेकेंडरी एंड देन प्राइमरी ओके सो विद दिस वी एंड द मॉड्यूल ओवर यर आई होप यू मस्ट हैव अंडरस्टूड अबाउट दैलोजिनेशन ऑफ अल्किस लेट्स मीट इन द नेक्स्ट मॉड्यूल विद द मैकेजम ऑफ दैलोजिनेशन रिएक्शन Till then, thank you, students, and happy learning.